is Bentley's gorgeous Continental GT convertible. We're standing at the back here because with the roof down and these lovely new elliptical tail lights and the lettering, I think it's the most beautiful angle for the car. Under the bonnet at the front, we've got Bentley's famous twin turbocharged six litre W12 engine. And that pumps out a remarkable 635 horsepower and a similar number for the torque, that's the pushing power. Both of those are very much needed because this little baby weighs in at a not terribly light two and a half tons. Combine that with the four wheel drive that this car offers and it's clearly not in a kind of Porsche 911 category of performance car but neither should it be. It's got four seats and really this is all about pure luxury. It's all about transcontinental touring at its finest. On the move, the acceleration from this car is seamless, as it should be when you've got this much power under your right foot. But it's the way it delivers the power. It comes in beautifully, quietly, smoothly, and partly that's aided by the extraordinary suspension system. There's air suspension here with continuous damping, which means you don't feel any of the jolts. And of course, Bentley uses the VW Group's 48 volt active anti-roll bar and suspension system which sounds like a lot of numbers and data you don't need to know about, but in essence means that it corners almost flat with very little body roll. It's a really impressive setup. We also don't feel that four wheel drive very often. It doesn't feel too lumpy. In fact, for most of the time, the power is sent to the rear wheels, only feeding power forwards when it feels a loss of traction. Inside this Continental GT convertible, it is, as with all Bentleys, like sitting in the very lap of luxury itself. Being a convertible with the roof down, you'll be wanting a bit more heating. So as well as the steering wheel and the seats, the centre armrest is heated, which is just a joy. And also there's an air scarf here, so keep your neck toasty and warm. Clever little touches on the Bentley include this lovely rotating screen. When you press the button named screen, it switches from a digital display to an analog set of dials and back again. We've also got in this car as standard the Bang & Olufsen stereo system, but Bentley worked with Name, a British producer who produced a very top-end one, which will cost you a little extra, but comes well recommended. Oh, and I should mention, of course, that on our cricket ball hide here, with our quilted stitching here with the leather, there's 2.7 kilometres of thread in the stitching. And finally, of course, this being a convertible, there's that beautiful fabric roof, which takes 19 seconds to fully fold away, so it's not the quickest in the business, but boy, does it look the part. That's the sort of attention to detail one gets in a Bentley.